I don't think anybody in Westminster really does understand the world outside of Westminster. Um, it's the residents that live in these areas know what goes on, where the problems are and how to tackle them. Um, and, I, and I think that uh, the government need to work with the communities more and more to, to try and solve the problems. Yeah, well, it, it would be nice to, to, to see, to see the, the big wigs, as they're called, um, you know, down in, in the areas that have all the problems. Um, but I think, you know, the, the government should stop cuts on community projects uh, and stop the cuts on policing. Um, and instead of trying to cut one thing to try and fix another, work them together in one big ball. Make, make the police work with the communities better um, instead of turning the police on the communities. The, I, I think the police are, are always out to make the people that make the areas bad, they're always after them in the wrong way and they're doing the wrong things and, and that's what's turning people on the police and that's why the rioting happened. Yeah, it, th that is the experience down here in South East London and probably all over Britain. But I mean, the police, the police ain't always with the community. I mean, you can't even walk to the bus stop just behind the camera over there without getting a metal detector run down your body in case you're carrying a knife. Now, I do understand knife crime in Britain is a problem, but running a metal detector down an innocent person that's on their way home from work or on their way back from shopping with small children, it, it scares people. It's, it's a scaremonger tactic, and it's not the right tactics to use with, with the public. Well, I know that I know from first hand that community uh, pro projects do, do make a big difference. Um, when I was 17 years old, I used to work. I used to go to a community project called uh, the Youth, Thames Mead Youth Awareness Program, just down the road here, and they do uh, studio and music uh, engineering. They teach people how to how to use st studio software. That they they let you write lyrics. They do lyric writing lessons. They 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 let you make your own tracks. It's a good way of getting anger and frustration out and make a posit positive of, of all the feelings that you've got inside you. And the. the but the funding for that got cut years ago and the building got closed down and, and the teens ended up on the streets. And I think stop, stopping cuts on those projects and bringing more of those projects out, you know, more public football events, more uh, fun days on, on greens, more, you know, stuff like that. It, it would help. It, would bring, it brings the community together. I mean, I, I started this wall on Saturday and the eerie silence running across Woolwich after the riots. Nobody was talking to anybody. We started the wall, the community started coming back together in this little area of pavement and everyone started talking to everyone and it, and it, and it works. And it just goes to show me, I'm just a, I'm just a resident of South East London, I am, I'm no one special and I brought Woolwich back together. Now if I can do that, I'm pretty sure the government can make, make time and make money to do that with, with professionals, workers that can work with the community. They do have a lot they want to say. I mean, there's, there's uh, a 74 year old man that wrote on there on Saturday, uh, a three year old child that drew round their hand down the bottom of the wall. It's, it's all ages, all colours, all creeds, all religions. Everybody's here and they've all got something to say. Some good, some bad, some are angry, some are upset. But this wall is, is, is basically their way of getting it out um, and sharing it with the community. And it shows the community that everyone is feeling the same thing. And that's complete outrage with these looters complete outrage with the rioters and you know they're not happy about it thanks a lot thanks a lot mate cheers we clear well done come up to the heat man well done that was very good very good Danny. thanks a lot mate good you got Got a good future, I hope so. Danny, I didn't hear a word of that, but I'm sure it was great. <laughs> Do you want to stop recording?